This is the um, Books of Horror, Support Indie Horror um, box. This was organised by Tiffany and the other people with Books of Horror, which is probably the single best um, group, page, whatever you want to call it, on Facebook. In many ways, it's not a lie to say it's pretty much the only reason I'm still on Facebook. Because honestly, the um, I'm just breaking the tape while I'm talking. The um, that group is just tremendous. It's brilliant for supporting horror, especially indie horror, um, and it's absolutely tremendous for learning. It's absolutely horrendous for your TBR and your book buying budget. But I figured while I was waiting for the kid to arrive from school, I would do a little unboxing of this haunted house. Books of Horror <laughs> box. Let's see. Well, okay, the first thing is super cool. Look at that. That's a Books of Horror messenger bag. Ah, oh, that's cool. It's got a little, it's got a little buckle on it. It's got a strap, zippers. That's the sort of thing, because it's fabric, that's the sort of thing you can put your enamel pin collection on. That's pretty good. Uh, something in an envelope. Oh, quite a few things in an envelope. Thank you for being in the Halloween box. I hope you like it. Now this, from Tiffany, because I am in this box and you'll see why in a minute. There's a magnet, there's a sticker, and there's a pretty cool Books of Horror pen. Thanks, Tiffany. It's an absolute pleasure to be in this box. Now here, holy moly, look at that. It's a plastic packet jam-packed full of pins, badges, stickers, bookmarks. There's an insane amount of stuff in there. I mean, look at it, look at it, look, look at that. Look, there's loads of it, it's just, there's, um, there's about 50 million bookmarks in here apart from anything else. That's awesome. I'll, put, I'll spend a bit of time looking through those later. A little Mike Salt goes a long way. I know that because there's a Mike Salt book in here. Uh, there's a piece of paper here that lists ah, so all the contributors and all the people who are involved. Um, and so that's where you'll see just down there. I don't know if it's very visible, but that's my bio on there because my stuff's involved. Oh, look at this. This is brilliant, Tiff. This is an amazing box. Look at that. A Books of Horror coffee keep cup. Love it. That's a good size, too. Get a good, get a good amount of coffee in that. Can't argue with that. Oh, I've just come across that, and it says open last. So, okay, we'll open that last. Let me just put these things away. Uh, and, ah, okay, so now I've come across a library bag, a Books of Horror tote bag and in here are some horror book things books of horror extra surprise asylum daughter natasha sinclair there's a whole book there oh that's cool and there's a little there's a little black envelope. I thought this would be a quick unboxing. I don't realize how much stuff was in here. Some business cards and stuff on here. The Suffering Poetry Book. Good grief, there's some stuff in here. Books of Horror. This is the little bookish part of the whole box. And in here we have Hollow by Mike Salt. And then we've got this little spread of tiny little chat books. Chris Kosarek, Josie's Prank Night. Blobbit, or Blobbit by M. Ennenbach. Double Dutch by Fallon Rains. And someone you might have heard of, Water Strangely Clear by myself. Uh, a little chat book of the story, one of only two um, actual Lovecraftian mythos stories I've ever written. Um, and each one, everybody who gets the box, they also get a signed sticker, book plate, 
to, to go in it and that's the case with each of these. Each of these has a signed sticker so they're signed limited edition, edition chapbooks that you can't get anywhere else. How good is that? And this says open last and so here we are finally got to the end and in the end Indie Book Boxes presents Books of Horror Pirate Edition sailing to you in December. <laughs> so that's the next one. And a couple of Indie Book Box stickers. Well, amazing. That's tremendous. Thanks so much, Tiffany. Thanks so much, Books of Horror. And if you are on Facebook and not on Books of Horror, unfuck that situation. It is genuinely the best group on Facebook. There's thousands of people there, and it's so supportive and so... Just the love of horror there is fantastic. So just go for it. Go and join up. Uh, and from me and the two panty dogs who've lied down now while we wait, I'll catch you later. <laughs>